Sorry for being. Alright, so we are on January 20th, 2019, with Down Darker Trail. A very nice fall to Christmas. And it's a great name. Okay, so last we left our hero, our in- intrepid investigators. Um, Sam, we're probably going to have you actually live in Wheeling. I think that's going to be the easiest way to get you connected with the group is once they get there, but that won't take too long. Uh, yes. I, I just thought it was a fun idea just to throw it at you. Because... Uh, I left on... Just tell me the idea. Oh, yeah, no, no, like, so she could be actually just sent as someone to keep an eye on things. Oh. To make sure um, things are... That's going right. to be up to Sam. Um, since you were at the last game session, you know what happened with him. Hey, do you want to be a spy, or do you just want to be somebody that randomly runs into these people and hits it off? Because I can... You think about that, and I can figure... I can make it work either way. Um, let's see. So, we're going to deal with the Travelers with the Crescent first. Yeah, I have uh, lots of things, actually. Yeah, okay. Coming up. Okay. okay. Um, interrupt me if anything happens in the time period that I'm going to throw out here. Uh, so, it's two weeks overland with the Buckboard what with the is, Crescent in the back. It's about Christmas, though, right? What? It's Christmas time, though, right? It's November. Oh, yeah. oh, okay. We're going to we're gonna, we're gonna quick recap you guys getting the Crescent where you want it to get. All right. Because I kind of ended the last role-playing journals in the last session. We were talking about what you were, what you were planning on doing. But it's two weeks overland to Jakali's house, which is a little cabin uh, tucked away kind of where? Describe me your cabin. Uh, like, or the land area around it. What do, you, what do you want it to look like there? So I think it's built on a hill overlooking a small desert valley mm-hmm. uh, in the kind of highland deserty area of very northern tip of... I think it's Arizona is what we decided. Uh, the the northern, I think it's the southern portion of Utah, because it's just north of the Navajo Reservation, right? Yes. So you're just off the reservation, just to kind of annoy the white man. And when Jakali <laughs> and her husband built the place, they wanted to make it as close to the border as possible to just screw with bureaucrats who would come by and try to incorporate them. Yeah, and then you get yeah, you can just like cross the cross the state line and screw you guys. Well, it's like cross the state line. Since it's built on there, it's like you know people ask you know is your house built in this state or this state, and they're just like, is it? <laughs> Here we go. Here's yeah. the one. So the Navajo land goes almost yeah. to the edge. Do you like right on here? the freaking border? Do you want to be? It's it. I mean, basically, this okay. as close as they can yeah. get it and have a nice space. Okay. So, so you're in southern northern mess. Arizona slash southern Utah. Yeah. Um, Okay, uh, so it's a real nice little place. It's probably pretty dusty. It's been months since you've been there. Yeah, I mean, it's probably also, like, kind of Spartan, I, I feel like, because like, most of their time was, you know, as a scout to place out and about. So okay. she has some facilities there, and but it's, like, not more than probably, like, 1, 1.5 people. John's late. Yeah. Check my LA dri- dri- driver going five, 15 miles per hour through in my neighborhood. That's okay. We're getting caught up. So, you find, you have, you have been to Jakali's house. Her cabin in the middle of nowhere. You could have been. Yeah, probably. It's entirely up to you. Okay. Everything looks just normal there. Um, here's another thing, though. On the ride there, those two weeks, were you trying to communicate with the Crescent? Mm-hmm. And did you touch it? No. Okay. But what, what what did you do? Did you sit in the back of the buck bar in the evening? I just, just stare at it and I like take thoughts. You open up the, the uh, open up the crate to look at it. And that yeah, stuff? like okay. yeah. All right. Uh, what about the rest of you guys? Are you doing anything with the crescent? I think Jacali is probably gonna wait to talk to it once it's like at home. Okay. Um. You do have really weird dreams that entire two weeks. Uh, you start getting ideas. Like you're getting ideas about like uh, 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 different potential different potentially different ways of uh, dealing with things like you know there's a reason why certain people die when they get blood transfusions and you're like there's, there's got to be something about the blood and these thoughts start to creep into your head. Um, Stelloy, uh, you're getting uh, you're getting ideas on certain uh, pharmaceutical stuff <laughs> that, uh, that 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 seems to make more sense now than it used to. Um, Jakali, and I'll need a suggestion too because I had trouble figuring out. Uh, um, the natural world, you're starting to get some insight into like evolution, um, how, how certain animals, why they react certain ways. Um, you're getting a better understanding in your mind about the stars. 
Mm -hmm. And maybe a way to make a device that could help navigate you, help you navigate better. Um, we'll deal with Link, with Auto when he gets here. Better, um, best GPS. <laughs> Uh, you're also thinking about ways to like, uh, yes. hey, if somebody turns on, maybe there's a way to resolve the GPS. By like, like breathing the air into doesn't there, work. or if someone has a heart attack, so CPR. If you guys can think of future stuff for your character from this time period, or a future time period, it's potential that you might be thinking it up. Um, nobody else wanted to touch the crossing, did you? I can't, I'm sure I'm having trouble remember, remembering if it was, like, really bad. Because I think it was, like, it does something to you. It could. It, just, it apparently turns some people to dust. Who are bad um, and touch right. it. And uh, some people who are not get, like, crazy talented gifts. Right. But you have no way of you know knowing what? much about You know that. what? No. <laughs> I feel, can I... Can it's going to be there when you come back. On the way, can I, like, think to the Crescent, like, do you want me to touch you? Like, um, do you want that? Do you, you, you don't really, you don't really get any kind of uh, any kind of reply or images. Just, uh, okay. Um, okay. So, and then once you get there, after two weeks, you guys want to bury it near the house. Is that the plan? Yeah, we're gonna okay. bury it in a spot that I know near the house, so that. Oh, and I was gonna plant poppies over it. Do you have any poppies? I don't know. Probably yeah. not. Fine. Yeah. I'm gonna go forward for just random seeds. Yeah, okay. You can and do I'm that. Gonna, you can I'm gonna plant like a flower bed over it. <laughs> okay. Are, are you able to search for seeds in, in, out I, of I am. I have a botany skill. Oh, give me a botany. Oh. That's perfect. Uh, so actually, and it's winter, so oh, that. that um, <laughs> <laughs> but still, you can make it, you can make an attempt. I'll make this straight up. What is your botany? It's like forty-five. Oh, or 40 I mean, or I have sixty-one natural world. I feel like hey, I might be able if, to. You can if he asks you to help him. You don't. Do you actually mention this, or you just go and do it? That's right. Well, that's <laughs> not. Well, it's not like you're like. Let's hope we can find some seeds. Uh, so, um, so all of you, uh, so meta, meta, all of your characters have been influenced by being in close proximity to the Crescent for two weeks while you camp and travel cross country. Um, so what? Do you lose sanity? No, no, you, you're not really having any communication with it. It's just it is affecting your mind, and you your characters don't know this. That in mind, you're just all of a sudden having great ideas. You can your characters can put it together later if you want. Cool. Um, it obviously doesn't have any physical effects on anybody or mess anybody up or anything like that. Mm-hmm. 30, 40, 40, 43 out of 40. Uh, uh, you know, it's, too, it's the wrong time of year to find seeds uh, and stuff. So, uh, it is good it's not surprising. Christmas. Yeah, it's, it's going to be like late November at this point. Um, Chicali's Cabin. When we touch the Crescent. And we'll do Whenever Chicali. I do get back, I do, I do go to Chicali because she lives in the area. And I'll ask her, hey, we need to like cover the, the whole love. Uh, can we find some seeds? To okay. Find, like a flower bed. You want to cleverly place shrubbery over top of the dangerous alien artifact yeah. that we've recovered. Also, I'm curious as also I'm curious as to whether the plants might gain sentience. They what? Ah, uh, nothing. <laughs> well, let's find some seeds. <laughs> Alright, so if I come back and there are talking plant people who are just chilling out at my home, <laughs> I'm gonna send them to you. They're your nice. problem. So we have that figured out. Oh my god. Okay. You can give me a natural world if you wanna try to find some something you can either replant over the spot or some seeds that'll grow or maybe even some bulbs. I got an eleven. Okay, what do you want? It is an extreme. What do you want? Do you want a shrubbery like you said? Do you want bulbs that'll be like uh, perennials? Do you want I think it's means zero, right? Yeah. I think but they won't bloom for a while. <laughs> no, no, no. Really they have a or do you want some kind of seeds that you think will grow something? Get a fern. Perennials die in the winter. But they leave a bulb, don't they? I just want a brief like patch of like arranged different variety of like. I, I suggest it. I, I want it to look somewhat natural. Okay. I suggest but, but like let's look for some pansies. You find some seeds that you think will do. Wild some wildflower seeds of some yeah. kind. I don't know nothing about flowers, so. I don't know nothing about flowers and in the and area or flowers. Uh, live through the winter. Do they? That's why I was picking mm-hmm. pansies. When you got an extreme, if you want some pansies, you can find some. Even if they're not in the area. They don't look great, but, you know, I mean, it's winter, but they're still alive. So that's up to you, uh, Ben. The snowball didn't get it all. I'm trying to create this space. <laughs> okay. No, I just want a nice spread that's uh, probably mostly yearly, or like maybe some things in there that like will bloom at different times. Okay, you got it. Just something there. It's something there, and it'll be something that will 
you'll you know, be able to pick out, and you'll be able to be like, boom, that's the spot. But other people, it's going to be tough for them to be like, there's something there. Um, is there anything else you guys want to do at the cabin, specifically? Nope, because we ain't got mine. Okay, well, exactly. So, you need to be at, uh, this is Meta, but you'll need to be at, in Denver by November, by December 11th. That gives you still a couple of weeks. All right. Um, it, on horseback, uh, oh, you're leaving the buckboard, aren't you? you yeah. Can, so the buckboard's also going to stay at the well, cabin. Actually, I would want to destroy it. Yeah, you could chop it up. I'm sure there's an and axe. And, like, burn it. And stuff. Yeah, so you could... Yeah. She definitely could use some firewood. Uh, you could break the buckboard down in a day. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a flat. I just don't want line. someone showing up at the house going, "Hey, that's the buckboard the crescent was on." Well, it looks like every other buckboard. There's nothing oh, really. Okay. okay. So, uh, still destroy it. <laughs> you can. So you chop the buckboard up. You take the the hoop, the iron hoops of the wheel and put them behind the house and bury them if you want. I'm taking those with me. Okay, you're going to hang on to those. Yeah. All the wood pieces are going to be broken down and added to the wood pile or burned in, yeah. the, in the fireplace in one of the nights that you're staying there. Okay. Yeah. So the buckboard is gone. Yeah. Um, yeah. Is there anything you guys want to do before getting to Denver? And remember, the, i got to be in Denver at this state is a meta thing. I will say I have to get everybody to like two things that happen in November. Before we're out of that, on November 17th, I have a candle communication check. Oh, okay. Uh, on November 25th, it's my birthday. Oh. Uh, and on December 9th, I get my check on English reading and writing. Yeah, yeah okay. Is Denver a big enough oh, city to, like, go to buy a lot of stuff? <laughs> yes. Okay. Denver's the capital of Colorado. It's a good-sized city. Oh, yeah. Um, you, if, if, yeah, you'll be able to buy stuff there. I was like, oh, did I buy that? I actually memorized the page number for this one. Here, here's my, I'm uh, just going to go ahead and change my age. Because yes, I for think it. that. Yes, what do you spell? 176. That's the number that's stuck in my head because you guys do it a lot. Here's my uh, Christmas list. How much will that be? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, the second one is however much you want it to be. Alright. Same with the. Uh, same with the books. All right. Uh, you can get a book for like a buck or fifty cents, depending on how nice you want it. All right. So that's up to you. So the Webley we're just going to say is about the same cost as a pistol. It's like a peacemaker, so that's let's say fifteen bucks. Right. And the rifle, uh, the, the rifle is twenty. Right. You're getting the uh, Winchester rifle. Right? Yeah. So thirty-five dollars plus. However much you want to spend on the other items. Alright. I mean, you can have a nice leather-bound book, and it costs you five bucks. Yeah. yeah. That'd be nice. So I'd say you'd be able to find all that stuff once you hit Denver. Okay. Checks. Sure. So, then? Yeah. We need an intelligence check. Hard intelligence to learn this about. Are you being taught this, or... I mean, yeah, he says that's too sharp. That's, that's right. That's because it's, that's why it didn't take long. So, we need that's hard intelligence. Knows. I'm good at this. The power one's going to fuck me. You can always try to push it. And Ophelia's teaching me, or helping me try to learn. Right. Uh, so I need you. my intelligence, but not hard. Not hard? Okay, you don't quite, you, you're not getting it. Um, so, um, Is there any, well, I don't think there's the same direct consequences of pushing this one, though. Uh, uh, you can't push the intelligence. You can't push it. Yeah. You, can only push the, you can only push the, I'm trying to cast the spell. So, um, so roll me a D8, and that's, if you want to continue trying to learn from her, and she's willing to continue trying to teach you, roll a D8, and that's how many days will pass. Seven more days is how much you work on. You're like drilling this stuff into her. Um, what other checks did you have, Ben? Uh, she's screaming at you, Ben. December no. 9th is my English reading and writing. Maybe, yeah, maybe we're you're... Just, it, just um... <laughs> so... Well, wait, we're doing reading and writing, you already know English. How long have you been working on that? I had November 9th and plus one month is what I read down. So I started November 9th okay. and we took a month on it. All right. Let's just say that you... What is your English on? Uh, I think it's 30 36. You can read and write now the equivalent of what your English is at. How about that? Oh. Because you've been working on this for a few months, I believe. Okay. We just haven't really documented it. So I can it. speak English fine, but if I like write something, I probably like need to make a check Correct. or something. Or if you're if there's a word like taxidermist or some long word that's not common for you, I, I can you might have to make a roll to see if you can understand what's written on the sign. Gotcha, gotcha. Um All right, what does that put my candle communication at? Because I'd 17th plus a week is... A week is the 20... Uh, 20. So, yeah, right here. So November 24th, so you can make another check. All right. Because we're going to go all the way up to December 11th, and then and then we'll get you guys on the train. 
Ah, I didn't bring my train. I guess I don't What other spells can I have? Uh. I have board sign, mind block, shriveling, and candle communication. Got it, 26. I don't know what else. Let's figure that out in just a moment. Uh, so 26, you need the heart intelligence. Ashton, you, you think she's got it. Mm-hmm. She just knows how to cast it. But, um, you're going to have to try it out. Yep. The first time. And she's not to cast it too. <laughs> right. Yes. Just, and you already know how to cast it. Okay. So at some point during that time, you guys both can cast the spell and see if it works. Like, you like walk go across yards a big rock something. and like hold up panels and be like, what? Yep. So I need a hard power, Jakali. All right. <laughs> <this> 17. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what this costs. Nope. You want to push it? it? That means that I go insane. Right? Yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. there is dire consequences is how it's put in the book. You can't have um, Either way, he's got a little kid in front of you. You see, the part of wants to know. to know what it would be, like, mm-hmm. when you already did the, like, cat curse thing. And there's also a part of me that's like, how bad could it be? Oh. How bad could candle communication go There's around? a list here. It contacts the elder god of fire. Hmm? He is not happy. Is he I was happy? sleeping! Ooh. No. <laughs> He's always very fiery. Oh, okay. There's some other things I hadn't read on here before. Okay, there are other consequences for the push spell. Yeah, but this doesn't affect me. <laughs> no, no, no. Not, I don't, I don't recognize it. <laughs> I'm already cursed by Bast. Good job. Okay. <laughs> I think it I'm not going to really. <laughs> no, no, no. Come on, yeah. Come on, it'll be uh, exciting. Hey, do you want to push it or not? It's, it's, you can okay, wait, how long will it take me to try again? Another D8 days. As long as she's willing to teach you, and then obviously you got some... If you decide not to push, that means that you got something wrong. Now, keep in mind, push is not a character decision, it's a meta decision as a player. Not until Christmas, we're going to be together trying this. If after we split up, I still haven't yeah. learned it, I'm going to try to push it. Okay, so I'm you're not going to push it this time. I just want to see She's still having difficult. She must but until work. then, I'll just keep trying and see if we can do more. Alright, so the 8 So it cost you 5 magic points, blah, blah, blah. We're going to be getting that back like that. So. Yeah. Yes, D8. This is how many days? Two, two days. 26. Of uh, November? Yep. Okay, make a roll. Remember, we're just working through the 11. Is that your birthday, the 26th? Yep. 25th. Okay. 25th. Okay. Oh, I so it's a day you got to get it done birthday. on your birthday, then. <laughs> All right. Now Push that I have another day. year of experience in the mud builds. Another swing around the sun. Good job. Not it. Definitely. Okay. I need 17. For another D8. Two more Ooh. days. 28. All right. There should be a calendar. And that's 13. Yeah. I got it. the intelligence check like crazy. What? You I have to do the intelligence each time? Yes, every time. Yes. Oh. Until you cast it. That's why you want to push it. Push it, push it. See, that made it under the power is what I was excited I'm sorry. So let's see what happens. You guys try it oh, out. Oh, no one. That's a 69. 69. Nice. Okay. That works though, right? Because it's... Nice. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Good job, man. You can push it or keep trying. Up to the 11th of December. I'm just going to keep trying. Okay. I'm, I, like I said, I think my plan is I'm going to keep trying this as much as I can normally until my fall well, after, after the trip is We'll open, deal with it up to the 11th and then we'll see. Right. So you're not going to probably be able to do it on the Four days. days. Okay. So, how many days in the winter? Where'd that black shirt? Here's a calendar. Uh, probably not 32. Sorry. I'm not wrong. <laughs> There's a calendar for it. So, 28th to what? So, December 2nd is... Okay, so December 2nd. Make a roll. So this is intelligence first. Every you guys are staying together yeah. after you leave the cabin, though, too, right? That may be intelligence. Okay. Hard well, school, I need to yeah. get shot. 23. Yeah. <laughs> Just in Denver. Yeah. It's yeah. Okay. 17. Hey, it's getting down. <laughs> Three more days to the 5th. Well, we've got to the 11th. That's, uh... Maybe intelligence. Okay, go. 23 now. Days. Uh, days. One more days makes it what? The ninth. The ninth. Okay. Yeah. Maybe it's the intelligence. intelligence. A lot of power. Fifty-eight. Okay. Can you need it. Four more days makes it thirteen. Thirteen. So mark December thirteenth. Okay. It's going to be hard for you guys to. Well, I guess you could just light candles in different 
train, train cars and try to cast a spell from under that rack. Well, see at night. Afterwards, when you go to bed, yeah. somebody might yell at you, but that's about the Thirteen? Worst. Okay. So we're good for bang. Nice hat. Dr. Mike's fault. I'm going to try to collect because she's learning something right now. Huh? Oh, okay. Learning. I'm also, uh, Philio's helping me learn Contact Geek. Yeah. Ah, okay. Um, yeah. Oh, I also have a question for you, yeah, yeah. Lori. Since you were the one teaching me reading and writing, are we going to keep doing that? Or should I mark off another month from now? Yeah, month. I'll do another mm-hmm. thing about it? Okay. Sounds like a good idea. You okay, Ori? Yeah. Uh, uh, that sneeze was a long time coming. Like, I could feel oh, the yeah, pain that's right. pressure in my nasal. Alright. It feels like that. It doesn't feel good. Um, 16th was the day for me. Okay. Uh, okay. November? Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, make a roll. I feel like we'll keep teaching you. Uh, that's 54? Nope. Okay, give me a D8. Uh, I also want a... Um, Six. Six days. Okay, so... 22nd? Yes. 61? Yeah. Okay. That's a 9! 28? That's a 6. <laughs> <laughs> this comes down on an 8-sided Yeah, but they underline just in case you forget. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I love that. So that's uh, 28. 28. Remember 28. 36? 36. Uh, I think that's... Is that a hard? Hardest half. 85, right? Uh, that's a, that's a success. Yes, it is 85. 85. Yep, you're good. Because you need 42 or less. Alright. So now, um, hard power. Alright, definitely do not push. Push 65. it. Push it. No, do not push Please, please, Yori. Uh, oh, yes, I'm going to buy Do not. Yori, do it. Yori, do it. Uh, so you're trying to cast it in your, and you are a failure. Alright. Alright, fails. Uh, what was that? 28 plus 7. The fifth? Yep. Yeah. 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 Oh, no, or 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 intelligence check, good. Really good. I, I know it too. Everybody's getting the intelligence checks, it's crazy. Oh, 17. 17. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's see what happens when I contact <laughs> oh, you. Oh my god. You're, con- are you, you're contacting me. But Ophelia's there with me. Yeah, I will point that out. Context, oh, ah, hold on a second. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, Ophelia might advise against this. Oh, does she? I don't know yet. Okay. Wait, didn't my grimoire go? Oh shit, I forget the Why would why would she teach it and be like, no, I don't count. I was about to say, is is that it? <laughs> Not right. Yeah, well we might need a sacrifice or something, let's find out. Okay. Oh shit, you gotta even think about what the costs were. That that's why I'm I'm Ugh. You need a newborn baby. Ah crap. No no no. Okay. Your character knows it. Meta, he can cast it. Okay. He hasn't tried it yet. Okay. But we're gonna keep that role. Because we need uh you're, you're one syllable away, and I feel like it's like, nope. No, 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 it's not even that. It's like, here's what you need to cast it. You have to find what, is, what she says is a sacred snake of Yig. Uh-huh. Get some of the poison from its glands, and those are super toxic to humans, especially. You, is, uh, is it about, like, and, I, and I, like, I, like, stretch long, and does it have, like, a crescent on its forehead? Yes. Oh, I've seen one of those. Where? Oh, back in the snake yeah, cave in Colorado. Yeah. 200 miles away. Okay, so what you need is, um... But yes, you, you prepare this poison potion, and then you uh, prepare a sacrifice to drink the potion, um, and then during the convulsions, the sacrifice is strapped upon an altar, while attendants chant the ritual. Uh, and then if the spell is successful, a child of Yig will burst out of the sacrifice's stomach, and then Yig will converse with the caster through the child of Yig for a few minutes, uh, and then um, the snake will... So we're doing this after Christmas dinner, right? <laughs> All right. So but I know how to out, do it if I ever need to. Yes. Your, your character doesn't know he knows how to do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. He's never really tried it, but we're going to keep that. So you do know how to cast the spell. It's just that you need certain specific mm, things. That's, that's why... Anything. That's I'm why... We'll just use Pete's son. I know he's a boy. <laughs> well, we'll see. Um, okay. Pete's son will So there, you know how to cast that. Um... You start having some, um... You know what I'm doing? Dreams. Yeah. Um, a lot of cat dreams. A lot of cat dreams. Yeah. Uh, cats are not happy. Anyway. They keep clawing their eyes out in your dreams. What can I learn? Yeah, good question. What can you learn? What, Wait, what, could, what, I, what could I use the remainder time for the right. candlelight? Candle spell? Yes. Okay. If somebody wants to teach it to you, we can give advice to double advice double duty. You know? Do double duty? And teach double duty. He wants to learn candle communication with you. Yeah. Alright. That's fine. <laughs> Wait, can I teach two people at once? Yeah. Okay. It's like a little class. <laughs> <laughs> right, so that's the tenth. So on the tenth. Thanks. No. Eighty seven. 
Six days later? The 11th? Or no, 16. Uh, 16. 16th, uh, so mark down December 16th. Alright. Because we're going up to the 11th, and then we will, we'll check during the train lane, too. Right. Oh, the, that, that one that you've got? I think so. Yeah, you've got a... I just, I have an explanation for it. I think I can okay. get to it in time. I don't Well, it's either at your house, or you're carrying it on your person. I have it in my okay. possessions. There you go, so let's go. Yeah. It's probably in a bag or something. Ooh. Or in the house. Okay. Or your snake bag. So this would last one you'd have to have made, right? Oh. Yes. Okay. Uh, well, I'm going to make probably that in the first one, too. <laughs> <laughs> Your last one's my favorite. <laughs> okay. So. I'm really curious. Uh, okay, so. Um, what spells... I'm going to have to grab out another... Uh, no book here. Good job. Hey. Oh, you're back there. Welcome, John. Thank you. Basically, perfect timing. Oh, thanks for everybody else. Yeah, uh, no, Macaulay's 33 now. Oh. That's right. That's what I'm looking for. I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at the, uh... Oh, you're looking for the pig. That's right, that's right. Yeah, I wonder if I think that's what I want. What did she teach you? Did she teach you the madness spell? Actually, yeah, we already know. No, she has, she already knows madness. You can learn anything off of my sheet. Yeah. She, I got, I, she I hasn't wrote down, shrivel yet. No, oh, I wrote down Vorisai and Mind Blast, Shriveling, and Camel Communication. Oh, so you do know Shriveling. You know those? Yeah. Holy crap. Okay. Um, Thank you, John. <laughs> There's a list of spells. Some blood, stuff on there. Hmm. Either one, do you know? Okay, here's no, a question for you. Uh, yeah, 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 Dr. Yeah. Dicebald. Are you willing to help her? Yeah, that's what I wrote down. Oh, I need a psychology check. You two are working closely with Cecilia. I need a psychology check from each one of you. From Steloid and from Lysol. <laughs> Rest of you are around, but, but Ophelia's pretty standoffish. Uh, where am I in this? Uh, you're with them. We're gonna, I'm going to check in with you in a, in a moment. You made it? How about you, Steloid? Uh, okay. Um, so, Dr. Lysol, so you've noticed um, that two-week trip. There was kind of a change in Ophelia, too, it kind of seems like. Um, she seems to be a little less cold, you know what I mean? Mm. Um, oh, almost as if, um, hey, hey, what are you eating? She's turning warm. Oh, good girl, good girl. She's yeah. evolving. She's going to be a smell nurse. Um, yeah, it just seems like she's warming up a little. She's not quite so aloof, cold, and distant as she has been, especially towards you. Um, that's probably why you noticed it. Um... And that's when, and, and, and after your, what period did you want to, when, about what date is it you're, you can learn your spell? Do you know? Uh, I think I wrote November 8th. Okay, so when, when, you, when you approach her about learning your spell, she, um, she asks if you'll help her. Mm-hmm. Because there's something she wants to do, but she doesn't know if she can trust anyone enough to help her with it. Yeah. So what do you want to say to that? Okay, what is it? She has a certain kind of spell that will um, help okay. you find others of her kind. She has been looking for others of her kind ever since she came to this time. And the only one she found was that major. Yeah. Um, and had a time. <laughs> 20 years ago. Um, there is a fine serpent folk spell that she can start teaching you. If you'll help her start to look for her own people. Yeah, I love Sneaker. Let's okay. do it. She, she warns you that they will not be as friendly as she has been. Well, I have a translator to go between. <gasps> But she isn't sure exactly uh, either because she doesn't know what the certain people this time, except for that one person, and she only talked to him for a few moments before you know mm-hmm. sucked back by the Yippians. Um So you can roll me a d8. We'll deal with all that. You're not trying to win spells, are you, Otto? I don't even know any Three. smart moves. Three, three days from that eight is the eleven. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I got one. I'm just messing. <laughs> no one around. shares. The I don't fact know if they've seen magic other than maybe a <laughs> uh, certain person. <laughs> My power is worse than yours. 
I'm pretty sure you've only ever seen affiliate cast members. Yeah, yeah, but I don't know yeah. anyone else, man. I just seen the. Oh, it's not just, not just yeah, 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 not just a snipe person thing. If you push fill, if you actually push roll, push the the power check, it could physically yeah, injure you too. Nope. Okay. Do you need D8 for the next one? Five. Sixteen. This is all the paperwork part of the game. Give me one of those cookies, please. Can I have those cookies here? For sure. I'm trying. I don't like them. They're too fudgy. Definitely whoopsie. Mmm. Mm. They're all yours. <laughs> I don't like them. They didn't have any mints today. That's why I got those. Well, I was saying. Well, there's sugar cookies over here, too. Nice. Nineteen. I'll just say, we'll, we'll stop on the way back, James. Um, or did his manager will be there? And I know him. We'll tell him we need some more pin notes. I like those pins. We'll always have them available. I'll eat too many of them. 29. Ah, two eggs. Are these intelligence checks you're doing there, Fail? No, the power. I did fail two intelligence, though. So. Okay. Is that bad? No, no, no. Make, make sure you do the intelligence check first and then the yeah. power check. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I was I I just I'm trusting you. I know you know what you're doing, Ashton. So I'm just kind of like, let you go. Okay. Yeah, you can do nothing. Uh, yeah, yeah. Don't look at me like that. Oh wow. Come on. 